Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see how to set up Google Cloud SDK on our local machines. So for this, let's go on to this URL. Okay, I, al I have already opened it. And what you do is uh, basically based on uh, kind of operating system or uh, your development machine that you are using, uh, you just navigate to the right uh, option. Since I'm using a Mac OS, uh, I'm here and download based on the platform uh, that that supports you basically download the respective package okay so this is what i have already done uh, i have downloaded this tire.gz i have extracted that and once you do that uh, let me show you that how it looks like so once you do that you should be able to see that so it I have downloaded it and extracted it under downloads so you should be also able to see this Google Cloud SDK folder once you download that uh, download the respective tar file and extract it you will be able to see this Google Cloud SDK and once you go into this directory and if you just do LSLTR then you will be able to see all the packages that are present as a part of Google Cloud SDK so after that, what you do is you just follow these instructions. Uh, I am not gonna execute this because I have already done that. Uh, so, but you know, it's a very straightforward one. Uh, you don't have to really about uh, worry about anything. Just go ahead, copy this, execute this. Uh, these two, uh, the next subsequent commands are optional because if you can see, it is still running the same install.sh file only but uh, here in the documentation they have just tried to explore that what happens if we give these two optional parameters while running the install.sh command so optional one no need to execute just execute this one and it should it, it will ask you some question that what is the project uh, that you want to configure these uh, connections for and which email id you wanted to log in with so give the right configuration uh, if you have already created the project like here right we have already created this particular project and i wanted to refer my google cloud sdk packages to this particular project so uh, I, so whenever it will ask make sure you give the right project id and select the right inputs after that it may ask you uh, for using which account you wanted to uh, do all these things all these uh, google cloud specific activities so give uh, the right account here whatever account you are using to sign into this particular uh, google cloud uh, console you can give the similar uh, credentials and those things there okay it might ask you to sign in one more time uh, once you give that okay i wanted to log in using this particular email id it might ask you to log in to the google cloud console one more time so just make sure you uh, log in that give the correct password click on sign in uh, it, it may ask you uh, some uh, more configuration like just click allow there and then you should be able to complete your uh, Google Cloud uh, SDK setup. Once you've done that, uh, you are supposed to, you know, run this particular command as well, which is gcloud init, right? And I think this is uh, the place where it will ask you to sign into your uh, respective account for which you have given your email address for. So just sign in and you are good to go okay so this is this is what for this particular uh, tutorial guys uh, thanks for watching this in the next subsequent tutorial i will try to show you uh, the key that we have created here like how to use this particular key uh, for the application specific authentication so stay uh, tuned uh, for more of such videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next one thank you